story out of Florida about a Florida man. As many, many a story begins with a Florida man. This in particular is a 73 year old Florida man from Miami. He was arrested on attempted murder and arson charges after police say that he tried to burn down his neighbor's trailer home containing two women and eight children because the women are lesbians. This is Braulio Valenzuela Villanueva. He's facing a hate crime charge over the fire that was sparked over the weekend at the River Park trailer park in uh, um, in at Northwest 27th Avenue, according to Miami Dade police. According to the arrest report, Valenzuela Villanueva had been involved in an ongoing feud with his neighbors that resulted in some heated arguments. So what did he do? Well, apparently at 425 in the morning, tensions boiled over and he went over and set fire to a mattress that was leaning up against the trailer. When police asked why he did it, he said he absolutely can't stand the fact that the victims are lesbians, also saying that every time he saw the two women kissing, he felt a deep repugnance. And in his opinion, they did not deserve to have children. Obviously, the children would be better off with a guy who's willing to set fire to a trailer where children are living. That's obviously the guy that you want to have children living with, not the two women, because that would just be dangerous to the kids or something. Um, OK, I, I am. Every time we have a story like this, I'm obviously completely shocked by it. But I have a few concerns because in spite of the fact that this seems like an open and open shut case, this is Florida and crazy things are happening and happening in Florida with their legal system. And I do worry. What if he says that his hatred of these women was really dictated by a, you know where I'm going, sincerely held religious belief and that that in some way should be a mitigating factor in the sentence that Mr. V Valenzuela Villanueva eventually receives. It's absolutely disgusting what happened here. And obviously he should be punished to the full extent of the law. But uh, I'm, I'm a little worried because every time I hear about Florida man does X, Y or Z, it seems like all bets are off. Absolutely anything could happen.